Going nowhere. Going nowhere. Brought down back at the 46-yard line. Like 20. Mason Rudolph may have done nothing wrong, but he still may be the odd man out. Trubisky rolling, rolling, and is wrestled out of bounds back at about the 23-yard line. On third and eight, Trubisky running out of time. And down inside the 20-yard line. Third move, the finishing move, all-out effort every snap. This is Harris. Harris can't get away from the tackle. He's better, even more athletic than we thought, and we thought highly of him when we drafted him. Going deep down the far sideline. That pass is caught inside the 40-yard line. Deontay Johnson on the reception. The speed of Johnson at the top of your screen, always in evidence, but look at the extra gear and the layout. The rookie, Jalen Warren, is in the backfield now on first and 20. Coming around from the other side is Gunnar Osheski, though, and Osheski. I don't know about you, but it's hard for me to get used to seeing Gunnar Osheski in black and gold when I'm used to seeing him in that Patriots uniform, returning kicks and running jet sweep. From 45 yards out as the Steelers look for the first lead of the game. On its way, and good. Jefferson on the draw, up the middle, looking for first down yardage. He has it and more. Tripped up and gets it out to about the 39-yard line. Look at how it was blocked up, and then look at where the gaps are. And nice vision by Jefferson. They gave him access to the secondary, and then his vision and footwork took him even deeper. See the cut there? And look at his head. As Boyle steps up, trying to escape and cannot, and goes down at about the 46-yard line, courtesy of Minka Fitzpatrick. Good protection this time, and that pass is intercepted. Picked off across the 40-yard line. Cameron Sutton. Sutton breaking to the outside and out of bounds. Cameron Sutton was the receiver. Watch what he's looking at downfield as he throws the ball. He's expecting that receiver on the in-breaking route. Never sees number 20 in black sitting in the exact spot where the receiver's crossing behind him. He thought he had Josh Reynolds, number eight, on the dig route cutting inside right there. Instead, he ends up with, with uh, Cameron Sutton. Najee Harris still in the game. Harris with the carry. Right side. Trying to shake tacklers. Can't do it and will lose yardage on first down. Trubisky on the slant. Incomplete. Inside the five-yard line, intended for Pickens and defended by Jeff Okuda. And that kick is up, and that kick is good. And with 12.32 to play here in the first half. And that is right down the middle. And with eight minutes, 46 seconds to play here in the first half. And they really think he's going to continue to ascend, and I believe him. Picks the ball up, throws it. That is complete to the near side. Caught by Reynolds out of bound. Nice reaction by David Blau. Picks up the ball, stays with his reads. A lot of times when you drop the ball initially. Blau, all kinds of time, running out of time now, and he goes down at the 45-yard line. No flag yet, and that pass is, that picked off, no, incomplete. Play on the football by Edmonds. They need the 39-yard line for a first down. Blau throwing over the middle, incomplete. To his left in order to get a better sight line. Down the near sideline, and the pass is caught. Trubisky down the middle of the field and it's caught inside the 10 yards to the five. That's fire move. The evolution of the athleticism of the tight end because in the old days, you know where that ball would be to the front side of Pat Fryer move. But because first and goal, that pass on the slant, touchdown Steelers, Steven Sims. 
totally understanding that Mike Tomlin would say, Charles Davis, you worry about broadcasting. I'll take care of the <laughs> roster. I do believe you're walking, looking at your opening day starter right there for the Pittsburgh. I'm with him on the invisible line. I got to work on that myself. On second and one, play fake. And now the short pop, and that's complete to Jackson. And Jackson rambling up the sideline, leaps, and is finally down. This is Detroit's first red zone trip. They're looking at a third and two now at the 18-yard line. Quick pass, and again batted down at the line of scrimmage. To Marvin Leal. Austin Seibert from 36 yards out. And the Lions finally hit the scoreboard. Your brother's on this team, Is Connor? It? Yeah, I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> I, I heard you you actually finally got to play with them yes. uh, recently. Walk us through that. Oh, wow. Third and ten. Has time on the move. Looking downfield, throwing incomplete. Intended for Olszewski from 45, from 34, from 38. This one from 29. And that one is blocked. 16-3, and Detroit gets the ball back. Put it in the right spot. Third and 10. Out to the near side, that's complete, and he is marked down. That's Connor Hayward. You know, what do you think he's saying to him? You know, you still didn't block me in practice. <laughs> Boswell from 54 yards, and it's good. On the run, and a big hole on the left side for Craig Reynolds. Well, they found something that's working, and it continues to work. Reynolds. Reynolds to the 20-yard line and another first down as the Lions are using the ground game. Second and goal from about the seven. Corner of the end zone. Incomplete. Blau on the slant. Falls incomplete. That pass to the line, to the goal line, and it's incomplete. It's ruled incomplete to Earl Pippleton. The Lions now from their own 26-yard line, and the give is to Reynolds, who goes nowhere. Hit hard by Khalil Davis. Play clock down to three, down to two, down to one, and they get the snap off. Blau coming across the middle. That pass is complete. And up to midfield and knocked out of bounds is Khalil Pimpleton. It was a lot of mis a lot of mistakes. There's a lot of things we need to work on, though. Um, you know, from the outside looking in, it may seem like it, but you know, from the inside out, you know, just of uh, the game planning. Now pulls it down and flips it forward, and that is Igwebuke here in the fourth. into the regular season. All those changes mean you throw out last year's film, right? Yeah, absolutely. You got, you got to go back to the film of where they were before. Oh, what a throw. Good pitch and catch. Trinity Benson on the receiving end. And Blau, under pressure, made the connection. A couple flags back there where he got knocked down, too. The goal line from the end of the play, automatic first down. Yeah. You're going to get you for that. I mean, it's just... Worst time of the year. Takes it. time of the year. Preseason winding down here. On first and goal, thrown away and complete. And it'll be second and goal with 36 seconds on the clock. You have to release the ball before the back foot crosses or the, or, or the, 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 the back body part. As long as any part. As long as we keep straight the no relation. <laughs> Onside kick. And. It belongs to the Steelers. No, no he no, had it, it the wrong way he first. Pointed the wrong way, right? Under pressure and down he goes. Carlos Davis in on the quarterback, and that will run out the clock.